Have you ever wondered how many cigarettes you've smoked in your lifetime? An innocent question, yet the answer may surprise you. Consider this for a moment. If you've been smoking a pack a day for the last 10 years, that's over 70,000 cigarettes. 70,000 moments where you've chosen to light up, breathe in, and harm your body. 70,000 opportunities to make a different choice. When you do the math, it's startling, isn't it? Today we bring you the stories of those who've been there. Imagine waking up every morning, your first thought being the need for a smoke, the craving for nicotine dictating your actions. It's a struggle former smokers know all too well. They've walked that path, fought that battle, and emerged victorious. Each story, unique in its journey, is bound together by the common thread of determination. There's Sam, a father of two, who quit smoking when his daughter asked him if he would be around to walk her down the aisle. Or Lisa, a marathon runner, who realized that to reach her full potential, she needed to stop. And then there's Mike, who quit on his 50th birthday, wanting to gift himself a healthier life. Their motivations varied, their struggles differed, but all of them experienced a profound transformation after quitting. Their health improved, their relationships flourished, and they tasted the sweet freedom of a life unchained from nicotine. Each of them had a moment of realization, a moment when they decided they wanted to live smoke-free. The damage from smoking is more than just a number. As we have explored, the health risks associated with smoking are profound. Lung cancer, heart disease, stroke, these are not just abstract concepts but real life-altering conditions that can be triggered by the simple act of lighting up a cigarette. The smoke that fills your lungs does more than just leave a bitter taste in your mouth. It stains your health, seeping into each cell, each tissue, each organ, wreaking havoc in its wake. It's a silent invader, creeping in stealthily, leaving behind a trail of destruction that often goes unnoticed until it's too late. But the damage doesn't stop there. Smoking carries with it a social impact that can be just as devastating. The stigma, the isolation, the judgment, they can all lead to a sense of loneliness and despair that is hard to shake off. And then, there's the financial cost. The price of maintaining this habit can add up, draining your resources, leaving you with less to invest in your future, in your dreams. But remember, it's not all doom and gloom, there is hope. Quitting smoking is not just about adding years to your life, it's about adding life to your years. It's about reclaiming your health, your freedom, your self-respect. It's about making the choice to live a life that is not dictated by the next puff. The question is, are you ready to take that step?